Hey, I'm William. Today, I'm going to show you how to check the main control on a Maytag washer that isn't spinning or agitating. Before we get started, hit those like and subscribe buttons if you want to join our do-it-yourself repair community and get notified each time we post a new video guide. With over 2 million products in stock and the know-how to help you do it yourself, we are AppliancePartsPros.com. Today, we'll need a multimeter and a 1 quarter inch nut driver. We're going to jump into voltage testing at the main control. And to do that, we'll need the washer's power on, so please be very careful here. Always take extreme care when checking live voltage so you can protect yourself from electric shock, which has the potential to cause serious injuries. Don't ever test live voltage if you're uncomfortable using a multimeter. Don't forget to turn off your water supply and unscrew your hoses from the washer. You might need a towel handy to clean up any unwanted water. We're going to grab the one quarter inch nut driver and remove the screws from the rear console cover. Using our tech sheet, we're going to set the washer into diagnostic mode and select the tachometer test. We also need to set our meter to DC voltage, which looks like a V with a solid and dotted line, and locate the J2 connector. We're testing from pin 3 with a black meter probe to pin 4 with the red probe. We're looking for 13 volts DC. If there's no voltage present, then the main control has failed. If you do see voltage here, we can move the red probe to terminal 2. With both our probes in place, we're rotating the basket by hand and we're looking for a return voltage. Once you're finished, lift the panel up and put it back into position. Then grab your quarter inch nut driver and put the six screws back to hold the top back panel into place. Don't forget to connect your water hoses and turn your water supply back on. If your main control tested good, you can check out our other troubleshooting guides to find out what might be preventing your washer from agitating and spinning. We've got thousands of videos to help you diagnose your appliances and make repairs. If your main control tested bad, you can order a replacement at AppliancePartsPros.com so you can repair it yourself. Make sure to let us know how the repair went in the comments. If you like this video, let us know by hitting the like and subscribe buttons. Thanks for your support, and we'll see you next time.